Yo, what is up guys? My name is Jax and welcome back to the channel. Today we are having a look at the brand new hero, Hero, coming into Smash Bros and is now available. We also have a brand new stage, brand new music and the update 4.0 to check out. So on screen now, you guys can have a look at all of the different features that is a part of online. So. First of all, very easy difficulty has been uh, added to adventure mode to help those newcomers to the game, to help them progress through, which is nice, especially for the younger generation. Um, we also have snapshots can be added to the uh, video editor, which is cool for people that are into that sort of thing. Um, the terrains have been adjusted in the uh, stage builder, which if you, again, are into stage building, good for you. Um, but it will mean that some of them might react differently, so... That's one of the things. Uh, spirits will appear in the shop based on the uh, new update and similar to the hero add-in from uh, Dragon Quest. So all of those focused onto there. Online tourney has been added. So like big tournaments and all that sort of thing can be added online, which is awesome. Uh, support uh, function for predicting the winner in Spectate Battle, which is awesome as well. Because then you can sit there and watch a few matches of uh, Smash, see how bad you are in comparison to some other people out there. So that's always nice. Um, so new downloadable content. So Hero Challenger Pack, we've got the Hero Challenger because we've got the Season Pass, but that's a good addition. Uh, we've also got a few different, uh, what are they called? The uh, Mies that you can uh, add like different costumes to, which is pretty cool. Um, so that's pretty nice for those people that do like to play as those. Myself, I'm not really too bothered about them. But yeah, there's also some other game balance updates and whatnot. But that's all we care about. So, Hero Challenger. Let's have a look at him. So overall, I would say that the hero himself is pretty nice to fight. His abilities, um, especially, I think it's his down B where you get to select the move that you would like to do is fantastic being able to just choose a range of different things. Um, we've got a self-destruct mode, which is like kamikaze, and you can just basically self-destruct. Trying to time that though, while you're trying to fight in the midst of everything, is going to be pretty difficult. That's the only thing I would say. Um, but he has good potential. I'd say just as like a normal playing character, he's quite good. Reminds me a lot of Robin with the way that it, uh, the hero uses the spells, but also like all of the different color variations for the skins. Um, the fact that you can choose one of four heroes, basically. Um, I know it's like eight, 11, and I forget the other two's names because wasn't too sure about those ones. Um, but yeah, let's have a look at the brand new stage. You get, you get drills altar. I don't even know how to say it. They said it in the little uh, interview that uh, the creators uh, made up for us, but uh, yeah. Alright, so here we have Hero, and we have all of our different options for uh, skins, I guess. So, they're not bad. There's a few of them that I would say are definitely my favourite. Probably the second one, um, and it's colour variation. First one, and it's colour variation. Um, but apparently all of them are based on uh, different characters out of the Dragon Quest series, which is pretty cool. So yeah, um, I'll leave you guys with a little bit of gameplay to finish up with. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and make sure that you guys jump on Smash, give it a try. I do want to stream Smash a little bit more, but uh, unfortunately with the way that um, everything is with the internet and whatnot, it just lags out too much, so I have to find a different way. But that's alright. So enjoy the footage, guys, and we'll catch you next time. Peace!